I'm calling this segment the Insider's Guide to Interviewing an Investment Advisor. And I'll set it up for you. You found an investment advisor who looks good, but you're going to talk to them, to interview them, to see if it's worth doing business with them. What should you be asking? Well, there's a lot of questions, but I would say the highlights are, first and foremost, how long have they been a practicing investment advisor? How many years in the business? Then I'd ask them a little bit about their business. How many clients do they have to service? What if they have a minimum account size? That's probably important to know. How do they get paid? And how are you charged for the services? Those are important questions to ask. The investment industry isn't always totally transparent with costs. Mm -hmm. What should I be looking for in the advisor in the way they communicate with me about costs? Upfront, honest, okay. direct, not evasive. It's on the table and it's important that the client does understand thoroughly. There's nothing wrong with asking. Okay, what else should I be asking? I'd like to know what products they're licensed to sell. And whatever that list is, what in fact do they offer to their clients? They may only be a mutual fund specialist. What should I be looking for in terms of credentials from an advisor? Well, first and foremost, they have to be a licensed advisor. And once that's the starting point. Uh, after that, it depends on what services you need. If you need financial planning, they should have their CFP. And there are more extensive programs after that they can go on to. But explore the credentials they have and decide if those meet your needs. All right, so make sure there are some credentials behind the name financial advisor. Absolutely. All right. Thanks, Betty. You're welcome.